you've flown the South African flag all around the world. We touched on a little earlier. When you look back at your adventures, uh, and particularly the, the Riviera series, the North Africa series, are there a couple of experiences on that trip, a couple of meals perhaps, that really stand out as ones that you'll never forget? More people, more people than food. Um, Look, if you take North Africa, for instance, and if you look at the life of a woman in, in one of those countries, it's such a hard life. They start early in the morning um, baking the bread. We, we go to the local supermarket and we'll buy our bread. And um, it just made me realize, it, as a woman, how easy my life is um, when you think of how hard they work and there was one particular lady that we filmed with and I was in her kitchen and we were making she has she doesn't even have a kitchen table she works on her knees on the floor ice cold in winter um, making the bread um, in this bowl this big wooden bowl and um, I just thought this is Backbreaking, absolutely backbreaking. And the the lady that we lived with um, in the guest house said, "Would you like a hammam later?" And uh, oh, we'd love that because you can imagine, you know, they scour you down, they take the black soap and then rip the skin off your body. It's very delicious. Um, <laughs> but if I can keep, <laughs> and um, when we were in this little hammam under the house, in came this lady that had long hair all the way down to her back the most beautiful, beautiful lady. Um, and she was going to do the massage and do the hammam. And it happened to be Miriam. We obviously couldn't see her at the house because she was all covered up. And the three of us, we just turned the whole thing around and we gave her a massage from hell. We brushed her hair, we washed her hair, we massaged her back. She had muscles running down the side of her back that were so tired and so hard. And we just did, so it was the people and some of the experiences that left quite an impact on me. Um, and obviously the food, I mean, love the food. Um, but yeah, people. Tonight,